In this quick little video, I'm going to show you guys how to change the skybox of your map. So you can see here we have the classic last resort skybox, which is really nice, but let's change it out. So to do that, open up your scenario and click skies. And then you'll see an element that says none and then a path to the sky. Click the three dots to the right of that and go up a few folders. You can choose a skybox from any other map. Uh, you'll see here if you click that, salvation, sky, and you can just select it and you'll notice nothing changes. That's because this requires a map reset. So at the top here, click scenarios and click map reset. Now you have to wait a little bit because it's redoing this little bottom left window. And this one you could see is kind of foggy um, not the best looking one, but one I really like is from Lockout. So let me show you guys that one. And you could just mess around with this stuff and see certain maps have certain kind of different looks to them. This is the Guardian one. And you'll see this is kind of cool. It has trees everywhere. And it's not really lined up too properly. But it definitely gives this map a totally different look and it'll also affect lighting of the objects that you've added in so you can see this bird now has this green tint to it so that's pretty cool um but yeah let me just go ahead and show you guys one of my favorite ones and we should be good then so in dlc you can use all these dlc ones as well and in addition if you go up to tags objects, there's a actual folder for skies that has some different ones here. But right now I'm just going to go back here into levels, DLC, lockout, sky, and show you this one. So there we go. It's kind of a nighttime look and pretty cool looking. And yeah, so that's it for this video and stay tuned for the next one.